Welcome to this YouTube channel. In this video we are going to talk about the top 10 most beautiful countries to visit in 2021. So before starting this video like this video, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for future updates. Which, in your opinion, is the most beautiful country on the planet? Perhaps the unspoiled wilds of Papua New Guinea will win your heart, or perhaps the tremendous diversity of the United States, will always hold a special place in your heart. Because beauty is in the eye of the beholder wherever, you think the most beautiful country is, you're probably not incorrect. Furthermore, you are unlikely to have visited every country in the globe, therefore you would not consider it fair to make such, a judgment on which is the most beautiful of them all. There are 193 countries recognized by the United Nations, so seeing them all, would take a long time before you could make an informed, decision about which is the most beautiful. Furthermore, how can one choose from the numerous intricacies that each country has to offer? For several years, we have been compiling the thoughts of your fellow travelers in order, to compile a list of the most beautiful nations in the world, and they recently announced their recommendations for 2021. This list allows us to fantasize about future travel locations, and possibly even add a country, or 10, to our bucket lists at a time when the tourism industry is in flux. Without further ado, here are the world's top 10 most beautiful countries. Number 10. Turkey. Turkey's allure stems from its varied landscapes, azure waters, and stunning buildings. It is a fascinating melange of European, African, and Asian civilizations, located in the stark center of three continents. The eighth wonder of the world, Hagia Sophia, and the nearby Topkapi Palace are the must-see sites on any Turkish itinerary. Then relax in the Pamukkale hot springs after touring the ancient remains of Ephesus and Hierapolis. Take a hot air balloon ride over Cappadocia for breathtaking views of the lunar landscape. Turkey's incredible ecosystem and habitat diversity has resulted in a wide range of species. Many plants that have been cultivated for sustenance, since the dawn of civilization originated in Anatolia and the wild ancestors, of many plants that currently provide staples for humanity still exist there. Turkey's fauna is much more diverse than the country's flora. In Europe as a whole, there are roughly 60,000 animal species, whereas Turkey has around 80,000. Over 100,000 counting the subspecies. The northern Anatolian conifer and deciduous woods ecoregion encompasses the majority of the Pontic Mountains in northern Turkey, while the Caucasus mixed forests cover the range's eastern extremity. The Eurasian sparrowhawk, golden eagle, eastern imperial eagle, lesser spotted eagle, Caucasian black grouse, red fronted seren, and wall creeper can all be found in the region. The Euxine Kolshik deciduous woods, which stretch between the Pontic Mountains and the Black Sea, are home to some of the world's rare temperate rainforests. Turkey and neighboring East Mediterranean countries are home to the Turkish pine. Several wild tulip species are endemic to Anatolia, and the flower was initially introduced to Western Europe, in the 16th century with species brought from the Ottoman Empire. Number 9. Norway. Ice-capped mountains and frozen tundra dot the land of the midnight sun. The best place to live in is also, without a doubt, one of the best countries to visit. The Geirangerfjord, which is situated between sloping mountains, is one of Norway's most photographed fjords. Polar bears, reindeer, seals, and walruses can all be found on the Svalbard Islands. One of the nicest drives you can imagine is the Atlantic Road, which winds its way into the Norwegian Sea. Spend a few days in the Lofoten Islands, which are known for their lush meadows, fishermen's huts, and sheltered inlets, if you're looking for an authentic Norwegian village experience. Norway is full of beautiful and dramatic vistas and landscapes. The west coast of southern Norway and the coast of northern Norway have some, of the world's most visually stunning coastline scenery. The Norwegian fjords have been named the world's top tourist attraction by National Geographic. The midnight sun, during the summer, and the aurora borealis, commonly known as the northern lights, are two natural phenomena that can be seen throughout the country. Norway is ranked 17th in the 2016 Environmental Performance Index by Yale University, Columbia University, and the World Economic Forum just behind Croatia and Switzerland. The index is based on health hazards from the environment, habitat loss, and CO2 emissions changes. The index mentions overfishing in fisheries, but not whaling or oil exports from Norway. Norway was ranked 60th out of 172 countries in the 2019 Forest Landscape Integrity Index with a mean score of 6.9810. Number 8. Samoa Islands. Although it is merely a dot on the globe map, this archipelago in Oceania is brimming with natural beauty. 
when you add in the Samoan's warm welcome, you've got yourself the ideal place to relax and unwind. Traditional Samoan rites are held at a few of the resorts and you may get a peek of the local culture by visiting the spas that offer native therapies. Hike up Ola Pupu Pue National Park or visit the Saliaula Lava Fields in Savai for some outdoor enjoyment. Number 7. Morocco. If there is one word to describe Morocco's beauty, it is exotic. It's a magnificent mix of African and Arab civilizations, with luxurious palaces, adobe forts, and brightly colored dwellings straight out of a fairy tale. The opulence of the Bahia, El Badi, and Dar Menabi palaces will astonish you, while the peacefulness of the Hassan II and Tin Mal mosques will leave you with a calm mind. Gemarel FNA Square's busy market is the finest place to acquire souvenirs and memories of your trip. Number 6. Greece. Greece's fame stems from its beautiful islands, archaeological sites, and delectable cuisine. This should be a must-see for any passenger traveling to Eastern Europe. Athens is a history buff's dream, with sites including the Acropolis, Acropolis Museum, and Delphi. With their boutique hotels, infinity pools, and whitewashed houses, the islands of Corfu, Santorini, and Mykonos scream opulence. Don't miss out on Metaora's monasteries, which will undoubtedly provide you with some much-needed tranquilly. Number 5. Peru. Peru's Amazon rainforests and Machu Picchu have made it a popular destination for South American tourists. The country has a lot of buzz surrounding it, but it certainly lives up to its moniker. Peru is a country where you may hike to Incan ruins and watch the sunset over the Andes. You'll never forget exploring the Amazon rainforest and meeting the indigenous inhabitants of Lake Titicaca. The Colca Canyon, which is twice as deep as the Grand Canyon, is a must-see for adventurers. And if you've ever been curious about the enigmatic Nazca Lines, this is your chance to view them up close. Number 4. Czechia. This European landlocked country is brimming with tourism attractions. The Czech Republic is a tiny country with a well-developed public transportation system, making it easy to get around, particularly in the capital, Prague. The Prague Castle, the world's largest in terms of area, is the city's main tourist attraction. Some of the city's oldest and most Instagrammable landmarks are the Charles Bridge, ECHV Bridge, and Palak Bridge. By foot, you should visit the Old Town Square and Wenceslas Square. Number 3. Rwanda. Rwanda's natural beauty and ecotourism have recently elevated it to the top of the bucket list of adventurous travelers. Volcanoes, waterfalls and jungles teeming with native species will provide you with an unforgettable vacation experience. National parks such as Akagera, Nyungwe, Volcanoes and Gishwati Makura, each with its own set of attractions, are a must-see. Relax and rest after your hiking adventures at Rubavu, a resort town on Lake Kivu shore. At the Kigali Genocide Memorial, see images, portraits, and artifacts from the horrible killing in 1994. Number 2. Greenland. Greenland's beautiful paradise is known for its fjords, icebergs, and glaciers. The country's otherworldly beauty, particularly in the districts of Alulasat Ice Fjord and Disco Bay, making it a photographer's dream location. Greenland has enough to offer even if you aren't a photographer. Whale watching is the most popular activity in the area, with tours departing from places such as Kuikuetazwak, Nuuk, and Aasjaart. You can also take an Aurora Lights tour if you are willing to wait long enough. If you're interested in learning more about the Vikings, visit the National Museum, where you can see their hunting gear, kayaks, sculptures, and artifacts. Number 1. New Zealand. This attractive island nation, which has been well lauded for its reaction, to the COVID-19 outbreak takes the top spot on the list by a wide margin. New Zealand deserves to be at the top of every bucket list, with everything from well-developed towns to well-preserved wildlife sanctuaries and well-kept beaches. Hiking at Mount Cook and Kahurangi National Parks is recommended for nature and wildlife lovers. Sail on private yachts amidst the abundant marine life in the Bay Islands for a taste of luxury. Operara Arches, Mount Stokes, and Stewart Island are great for people who wish to venture off the beaten road. New Zealand's 80 million year geographic isolation and island biogeography have shaped the evolution of the country's animal, fungus, and plant species. Physical isolation has resulted in biological isolation, resulting in a dynamic evolutionary ecosystem with unique plants and animals as well as populations of widely distributed species. The flora and fauna of New Zealand were assumed to have evolved as a result of New Zealand's separation from Gondwana, but more recent research suggests that species evolved as a result of dispersal. About 82% of New Zealand's native vascular plants are endemic, 
with 1,944 species divided into 65 genera. So what do you think of this result? Is there a country that you believe should be within the top 10? And do you think that which one is worthy of the top spot? Let me know your opinions in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.